Hello, I'm Chris. This is Gross Models. Welcome to issue 110 of Building the DeLorean. Uh, this is the, the spare issue, the spare tire issue and the windscreen wipers. Uh, not a lot of building to do. We did a fair bit last time. So uh, yeah, we're putting the wheel together and strapping it into the front where it goes. And then we're just popping the windscreen wipers in place as well. And that's it for the car for a little while. We can put the, the whole heavy, massive thing out of the way for a brief while. Um, while we continue working on a different part. Uh, take the ride of your life. Uh, this must be the uh, another spin for the DeLorean, the Back to the Future, the ride. Yeah, I've not, not seen it. I'm, I'm aware of it, but not, not done it. Uh, Ken Ralston, I don't know the name. There we go. Uh, yes, yeah, so next time we are starting the reactor base, the whole back area. So we're building some of that. That's going to be good. I like to work on a separate bit and then we'll install it. Even having to mess around with a huge thing again. Uh, you can imagine the picture of the spare tire and the windscreen wipers on the back there. But imagine for not much longer because I'm going to get this out of the way and we'll put it together. So here we have the windscreen wipers. Are uh, they're all right? They're plastic, but they're a little bit bendy, so they'll be fine. Uh, they are different, so you do need to make sure you get them on the correct sides. Uh, they are different, or are they? No, they may not be different. They were just. Uh, angled slightly different so they looked a bit different but i think they may in fact be identical so you might not have to worry which side goes which uh we'll be putting the wheel together and putting some screws in to hold it together so we've got uh again the nice wheel is there a side that's better than the other really both about the same so we'll pop that through the back we'll put that through the front, no we won't, yes we will, uh, it doesn't matter which way round it goes, so get it the right way round, we've got three and a three, should locate in place, if not then it's probably not the right way round, that's it, there we go, that's that in place there, so three BP screws will hold that together, Put one and the label in there, put that over in the pile of spare stuff. See these go in from the back. I think this tire is slightly smaller than the ones on the car. It's obviously less complicated, it hasn't got the brake or anything fitted to it, it doesn't have to flip. But uh, it's quite nice to have a spare. Adds to the as to the weight of the kit, because it wasn't heavy enough to begin with. There we go, that's that. Uh, now, ordinarily that would help be screwed in place, but it isn't. But you've still got to put the little washer in there, and then the little hub cap. Or nut cap. Goes over the top there. Right, let's bring in the car and put it in. So, it makes sense to do all this together, because it's easier to fit the windscreen wipers with the thing open. So let's pop those on first. I know it says to do it second, but we're going to go in first. They just locate in place. In there. A bit like that. Adds a little detail. And this goes under the strap. That will stop the strap getting caught all over the place as well. So yeah, we can just work the strap round. Like so. Oh, before I do that, I was going to have a look. No, they seem to be about the same size as the, uh, the real tyres there. The same thickness, the same diameter. Yeah, strange. So, pop that in there again. There we go. It locates in there quite nicely. And that is another issue done. Uh, I shall put the car into storage for a little while because we're going to be working on that reactor base and then installing it. So it's nice to get this out of the way for now. So uh, other than that, thanks for watching. Stay safe. I shall see you very soon for more. Bye bye for now.